Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Dark Envoy with me, Bring It On. Let's return to Free Phoenicia and turn in these quests. So technically, Malachi and Kayla tied in offense, both taking three categories. And then Benedict is still carrying the team in defense and utility. Remember to never leave home without your Benedict. Can't unwind. Ain't no rest for the wicked, <laughs> Frank. I'm just thinking about all that's happened. You know, the war and how we contribute to it. I don't think mom and dad would have been proud if they saw us now. I know. And there's still nothing tangible on the claw. Not really. Despite all of our efforts, it feels like we're running around in circles, fetching errands for no payoff. You didn't rest either, did you? How's your research into the Oracle going? I haven't learned much yet, but there's a voice in the back of my mind telling me I missed something important. As if someone has been nudging the back of my brain. I can't really describe it. I guess I need to sort it all out of my head. We can talk about it later. For now, we might as well head to the embassies again. All right, I can't take Malachi seriously with that helmet on, so we'll fix that real quick. After we do some research. Now let's grab improved modifiers too. Upgrades the quality of random modifiers on crafted items. So you get four enchantments with armor enchanting three, and only three enchantments with jewelry enchanting three. So we'll grab this one. So unlocks enchantment recipes for armor, inner self, berserk mod, leadership, and guardian. All those seem pretty good. Inner self gain plus one to all attributes seems pretty good. So you can roll skill power here. Hey, it looks like it's only going to give me dodge chance. I'll take it. It does offer critical chance, but no weapon damage. Or skill power. Skill power is tied to the Elven equipment. Alright, I'll take that. Doesn't quite match, but <laughs> looks better than that other helmet.
Ah, uh, that looks like an upgrade too. I'm gonna grab that. Yeah, that looks pretty cool. Uh, this might be an upgrade for somebody. I think I want to focus more on crafting going forward, so I might start spending all my money on um, resources, but let's see what unique they sell right now. Revenant's Heart. Projectiles count 5, lifesteal plus 20%, resistance trip plus 7%, and Force Nova is the unique weapon skill. That controls a wave, waves of numerous energy projectiles in a pattern around the caster. Each projectile deals 40% weapon damage to the first enemy hit. I'm not giving up 22% skill power. I have more stuff to sell. pricey but probably worth it. Let's go check the challenge board real quick and we'll go talk to these people. Uh, level 10. Not quite there. Job's done, and here are the documents you requested. The Empire won't be able to continue their operations there for a while. I know. Our scouts have already returned to confirm your success. Excuse me? You proved to be valuable assets. Congratulations. We also know that you sabotaged the Empire's machinery. Such initiative is very appreciated. We had to, after seeing what it did to the area. I just hope the resulting mana fluctuations won't affect neighboring settlements. Hmm. I see. That's very dangerous information you gathered. I'm sure I don't have to remind you that your contract ensures discretion. Especially since we'd be very interested in working with you again. Of course. Don't worry, we're not in the business of spreading rumors. In fact, it's quite the opposite. We would gladly forfeit part of our payment if you can provide us with some intel we're after. I can't guarantee anything without knowing what it is that you seek exactly. We want everything your intelligence has on the claw. We're a bit of legend hunters, you see. That's an interesting query. Very well. I'll send word, see what I can find out. In the meantime, I've got another task in mind that should be befitting your talents. Here are the files. Get to it immediately. That's it? No please or thank you? This is war, human. We can fraternize after it's over. Ouch. Can you at least give us a brief summary of the mission? A village that supplied us with a particular type of dense hardwood stopped sending its shipments. We're afraid that they may have been targeted by the Empire. The well-being of the people in the village is nearly as important as the resources we get from them. It's critical that you investigate it immediately. And if we do this, you'll give us the information we asked for, right? Yes, yes, now get on with it. All right. 
4700 experience, 200 gold, sure, so I guess we get the same amount of experience from the Empire as well. We're gonna be close to leveling up again. <laughs> no, I'll take it. We can just teleport, can't we? You're back. <laughs> I knew you guys could handle it. Our scouts confirmed that the mine went silent. Good job. Here's the pay. All in a day's work. Although, turns out the miners weren't actually slaves like you told us. That's a surprise, isn't it? Yes, our intel may have been a bit outdated. The mine needed to be shut down anyway, though. So, it doesn't really matter. Anyway, you did good, kids. We'll have plenty more jobs for you. High-paying ones. Let's not get ahead of ourselves. How about you pay us with some information instead? Ah, negotiating, I see. I'll bite. What would you like to know? We want everything you've got on the claw. Reports, rumors, alleged witnesses, all of it. The claw. Now that's a weird request. You kids chasing spooky monsters. Have you checked under the bed? Do we have a deal or not? All right, all right. Tell you what, you do another job for us, and I'll see what I can learn about your boogeyman. Sounds fair. Now then, we'd like you to burn a bridge for us. Uh, are we talking in code now? Not at all. We want you to quite literally blow up a bridge the League captured. We've sent some operatives to do it already. But time is of the essence, and they seem to be slacking. Finesse be damned. Blow that shit up and report back to us as soon as possible. What about the operatives? What about them? Lassie, they are professionals. Finest you can get. You won't blow them up by accident, I assure you. The quartermaster will supply you with explosives before you leave. All right, we'll be on our way then. Good luck, soldiers. Long live the Empire. Just a little walk. Excuse me, can you please spare a moment? Nope. Of course. Is something oh. wrong? <laughs> My name is Amelia Giano. I overheard you talking to the recruiter there. I believe that you're being sent to a region my husband was deployed to. I haven't heard from him since, and I'm starting to get worried. Could you please keep an eye out for him? Sure, I guess. Uh, any distinct features, you know, other than a uniform. He's tall, with short, dark hair, and has the prettiest smile you've ever seen. Oh, and he's quite a chatterbox. I'm sure you'll know him when you meet him. Yeah, that's helpful. Don't worry. We'll let you know if we see him. Thank you so much. I'll be coming by the embassy, awaiting your return. They need to step up their security if a random civilian can hear what we're talking about over there. Let's get going. Prettiest smile you've ever seen, hmm? Pity the Empire helmets make sure to keep that out of the picture. Gotcha. Alright, so let's say we have a couple companion quests. Let's go talk to Benedict and Vaso. Also, real quick, let me check some more crafting.
Let's go do this just for the aesthetic. Make that'll look better than what he currently has equipped. Is everything all right, Vasso? You look troubled. Oh, please don't be alarmed. It's just that something unexpected happened and I'm not sure how I should react. You see, I received a letter from an old friend. They want to meet me. One of the few who remained by my side till the end. But that was a long time ago and we didn't really part on good terms. Maybe enough time has passed for you to reconcile. Would you feel better if we accompanied you to this meeting? I think I would like that. Thank you, Kayla. In fact, it could be a good networking opportunity for you as well. We're likely going to have to deal with the League whether we like it or not. It would be good to have dependable people on our side. Sounds good. Just show us where you're supposed to meet and we'll try to get there as soon as possible. Hey guys, are you busy? I'd like to talk to you about something. Got a letter from Dean, my deputy in the City of Bones. It's a bit alarming. What's going on? Do you remember the League troops that caused trouble on the outskirts? The ones hell-bent on finding an ancient archive out in the desert? It's hard to forget. It appears they're back and causing trouble again. They took a few people hostage as part of some investigation. But that's not all. I took up this matter at the Embassy and was told that the League has no troops stationed in the desert. Well, we already know that the Elven Nobles are prone to infighting. Maybe those soldiers aren't acting on League's authority. Came to the same conclusion myself. I take it as permission to act. Do you want to pay the city a visit? I wouldn't want you to feel forced to. You've got enough on your plate as is and your memories. They are probably still fresh. But I'd sleep much better knowing this matter's been properly sorted out. Of course, Ben. We'll drop by as soon as we can. <laughs> you two are truly cut from the same cloth as your parents. I appreciate it. Sure, why not? All right. Just sell this helmet real quick, and then we'll try this challenge after we level everybody up. Attributes. Uh, let's go ahead and focus on. Hmm. Let's go do speed. Because we have the weak point ability or skill. Then we're going to max out charge ground. So it lasts for an extra second. It does an extra four shock damage per second. Oh wait, oh we only get the specialization points this time. Never mind then. Oh, let's go max out chain lightning. That's an extra 80 shock damage. With the initial hit. And an extra 80 shock damage on the arcing hits as well. All right, Kayla. Our right, more points into power. Let's go do summoning proficiency. So gain plus two summon points. We could get another summon. Let's just upgrade Call of the Wild. Hey, Benedict.
Let's go and get Might up to 10. Which unlocks his weapon ability. Because I think that unlocks Shield Bash if you have a shield equipped. And that also boosts your armor when you use it. Uh, let's put a point into Juggernaut. So physical resistance goes up by 5%. Uh, same with elemental resistance. And then Shieldmaster 2. An extra 25% weapon damage on top. So 50% extra weapon damage. And a 20% chance to knock down an enemy while using a shield. That goes up by 10%. Alright, and Might for Cestia. And we'll max out Headshot. Again, if we're using up all of our mana to use an ability, I want it to hit as hard as possible. Alright, Mastery for Leon. And we'll max out the Construct Sentry. And for Vaso, more power, and we'll max out the Metagold. Alright, Engineer Squad. Find a squad of enemy constructors and try to take them out before they overwhelm you with turrets. We'll get Nail Gun. Mana Drain plus two and a unique weapon skill. Summons a Flamethrower turret for 10 seconds. And 900 gold. Party members four, enemy waves zero. Uh, not Leon. Let's bring Benedict and Cestia. So between all the new companions, Cestia, Vaso, and Leon, I think Cestia's my favorite. Mostly because she's a class that we don't have represented in my party yet. Where Leon's redundant with uh, Malachi and Vaso's redundant with Kayla. Follow me. Yes. Yeah, that's me. Yeah. Speak. What do you propose? It's a good sort of my summons, but it puts the abilities on cooldown anyway. Kind of annoying. Uh, time for plan B. What's the plan? One of the engineers down. Uh, we'll take out the. Salt guys, I guess. And look to see if the engineers. Some of these guys are not. I'll probably just run this guy down, actually. Yeah. Well, Benedict tanks these guys.
bad. Speak your mind. All right, well, that was easy. <laughs> All right, what level is the next challenge? Eleven. Bob's Revenge. Oh, that's right. Bob was the one we had to fight. Gotcha. He was the uh, the rat guy, right? So that's the main quests. Uh, that is a companion quest. Alright, we'll do Benedict's quest first. At the City of Bones. And then we'll do Vasos, and then we'll focus on the main quests. Sounds interesting. Teleport there. Oh no, the Parker deactivated. Oh, coin to spare. Please, I'm hungry. Sorry, I didn't catch that guy was talking to us right away. He's asked for a coin to spare. If we had a coin to spare, he was hungry. It's good to have you back. At ease, soldier. I am no longer your superior. I should be the one saluting you. What do we have here? Returning to pick up the mess you've left behind? I heard you were elected counselor, Jahan. I truly want to believe that you've changed after what happened to the city and found a new calling. Whatever makes you feel better. Anyway, we have a problem at hand, and I assume you came here to help the city handle it. You've assumed right. Civilians are going missing, sir. We're certain it has something to do with the elves terrorizing the outskirts, but we're in no position to do anything about it. If it were up to me, we'd get rid of them once and for all. But the rest of the council is too scared to challenge them. They want to settle it diplomatically, as if that ever helped anyone. I'm afraid that's out of the question. I was told the League Embassy in Free Phoenicia is no way affiliated with these invaders. We're on our own. And we can't just wait for them to strike again. It's time to take the fight to them. Now we're talking. I always knew you were a smart guy. As you wish, sir. Let me just get the boys in. No. You stay here and make sure the people are safe. It's our mess to clean up. Just point the way. Yes, sir. Understood, sir. The city's changed so much since we left. It barely feels like home anymore. I know what you mean. I can't help but feel we're partly to blame for this. Let's get going. Sure. All right, a desert outpost. Try not run the past is as futile as attempting to shift, sift ashes from the sand. That's the place. Remember. The soldiers here are not working with the League. If they attack, it's within our rights to defend ourselves. Got it. Let's find our people and bring them home. I hope we're not too late. 
All right, I'm gonna call it here. Next time, we'll knock out Benedict's quest, and if there's time, we'll do Vasto's quest as well. But for now, thanks for watching. Hope to see you guys in the next one.